I think it's so cute with my hair. Oh, I love it! I can barely see, but I know that looks good. Hey guys! So we love Kumi Creator. Yeah, that's pretty obvious. We both made flower power bracelets. Twinsies! We're a bracelet to match our outfits. Oh, like, yeah. how cool is that? Well, how many bracelets do you think we've made? Chloe, I actually don't think I can count that high. <laughs> Fair. Uh, what about necklaces? None. Not yet, anyways. Want to make some with their Kumi Creator 2 in 1? Oh my it, god, yes! It makes bracelets and necklaces. That's actually my dream come true. Can we it unbox really this like, right is. now? Yes. Please? Let's do it. I thought it was a growl. Here's everything you get with this kit. I'll pick that up after. Spoiler alert, there's a lot of spools. Oh! <laughs> Oh my god. I'm this. For making bracelets, you get one Kumi Creator 2 in 1, 44 white bracelet spools, five silver bracelet clasps, 10 blue end caps, one bracelet design booklet, one bracelet measuring guide, and one clasp sticker sheet. For necklaces, you get 16 necklace spools, two rose gold necklace clasps, four black end caps, two tassel bases two tassel charms, one necklace design booklet, one sticker sheet, and one playbook. Chloe! Yes? Do you want to make necklaces for each other? Yeah, it's kind of our thing. Yay! Let's do it! Before you actually spin up a necklace, you've got to know some important things. Probably the most important things. When you open your packet, you'll see white bracelet spools and black necklace spools. The black necklace spools have double the length of thread. There's also a different design booklet for necklaces versus bracelets. Careful not to mix up the spools. You don't want to make a bracelet when you're trying to make a necklace. Time to pick your pattern. Then, based on your pattern, grab your colors. Then, get the machine ready. Follow these steps carefully to make sure it's good to go. Attach the purple arm to the base. Flip the white tab up. Push the white arm down with your finger. Turn the handle clockwise until the blue spool gaps and the blue posts are lined up. If they aren't lined up like this, you won't be able to make your pattern. Now it's time to snap in your spools. Here's how. Hold your spool with the string end facing out. Don't unravel the string. Snap the spool into the holder until it clicks in. Pull the string out from the spool and feed it through the top of the holder. Using both hands, push the string into the purple hoop. Then slide it into the white string slot. The top of the string should be about this long, right here. Finally, turn the spool dial to tighten the string. Then, do the same thing for the rest of your spools. Heads up! You make necklaces using only eight spools. See these X marks? That means you don't insert spools into these four spool holders. Guys, this is where the magic happens. Push the white tab down. That unlocks the white arm. Now spin. Turn the handle clockwise and watch your necklace spin up super fast. When these red lines meet, stop. Peel a sticker, now wrap it tightly around the braid. Pull the white tab back to unlock it. Then, slide the braid out from the white string slot. Bring the white arm down. Hold the white arm down while you push the white tab down. Keep holding the white arm down while you slide the braid into the necklace groove. Place the braid into the necklace guide. Now, turn the handle again to continue the braid until the red lines meet. Pull your braid out of the necklace groove. Repeat this process until the first spool runs in a string. Heads up, don't keep braiding once the spool is empty because it will tangle. When it's done, wrap a sticker around the end of your braid. Pull each string out of its spool. Remove your necklace from the machine. Trim your string ends close to the sticker. Check it out. That was basically just as easy as making a bracelet. Yeah, it only took like 10 seconds longer. But we're not done yet. Huh? We still have to make a tassel and add a clasp. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> to make a tassel, follow these steps. Grab the extra thread from your necklace, a tassel base, and a tassel charm. Then, take a tassel base, place one string into a slide slot, and hook it tightly. Turn the tassel base, put another string into a different slot, and rotate a third time to the last slot. You can put up to two strands of string in each slot. Click the tassel base into the tassel charm. Trim the ends of the string so they're nice and even. Then, just slide the tassel onto the necklace. Now all that's left to do is add the clasp. First, grab a rose gold clasp and two black end caps. Remember, the blue end cap and silver clasp is for bracelets only. The 
got to use the right ones. Pop apart the clasp. Push the end of the braid through the smaller end of the clasp. Pull the braid out a little. Then, attach an end cap just below the sticker. Pull down the braid into the clasp. Then, do the same thing for the other side. If there's a little extra string, trim it with scissors. If you're having trouble closing your clasp, twist the necklace to pull the clasp down. You've got a cool new necklace. <laughs> Can you bring it on me? <laughs> okay, watch my gorgeous hair. I love it! I can barely see, but I know that looks good. <laughs> Sorry, girl. Where's where to go? Oh, there it is. Oh my god, it looks so cute. I love it. I know. Let's you look so cute, too. I know. Come here, let's take a picture. Okay. Oh my god, it's okay, you gotta show up in our class. <laughs> Amanda, what should I do if they want to make a bracelet? Oh, it's super easy. Just use the Kumi Creator 2-in-1 as you would the original Kumi Creator. The only difference is that the new machine is purple, not blue. Now let's make an 8-strand and a 12-strand for funsies. Yes! <gasps> I swear to god, something... Okay, maybe not. I'm just being dramatic. No, there was a spider. <laughs> If you guys have any issues while trying to make a bracelet or a necklace, like spool jam or string jam, check out the troubleshooting links down below. Yeah, don't worry, you can fix this. Totally, we believe in you. Hey Chloe, you know what we should do? Hmm. Make some bracelets and necklaces for our friends. Yes, I think Eric would look really cool in a necklace. Yes. Oh my god, yes. He probably won't want to wear it, but we're making it for him anyways. Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching guys, have fun with your new Tumi. Tumi, ha! <laughs> Thanks for watching guys, enjoy your new Kumi Creator 2-in-1. Bye! Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you think we're hilarious and fun, um, make sure you check out our vlog, Handcrafted. What? That's cool. <laughs> cool Maker Hangout. Make sure you check out our vlog, Cool Maker Hangout. Yeah, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye! Bye. <laughs>